students must be shocked today. Teachers, if your student has not been shocked, please send him or her to the office. And remember, the Millard Fillmore Fighting Ferrets need your support. Thank you. Let me tell you why this kid's a jerk. You have to see them as pure potential. Oh, great. Let me tell you about this potential jerk. Why do you let him get he to you? He cheats, Mr. Penny. I will catch him and I will deep fry his ass. When he applies for a job, I'll make sure that they know. Miss Harlow, he's a kid and you're the adult here, okay? If he cheats on his test, it will catch up with him one day. One day? I want to catch him now. I want to catch him doing it right in front of me and I want to see his face when I say to him, you're a cheater! Technology leads to cheating. Cheating leads to crime. Mm-hmm. We need to get back to the basics. You know what we need to start using again? Hmm? Do you? Do you? Huh? Do you? The pencil. Kids don't respect pencils like they should. The simplicity of a number two pencil. A sharp yellow, long number two pencil. Oh. What a sight. You take it and you slowly insert it into a manual sharpener. Not too fast, not too slow, but just right. Then you pull it out and there it is. A nice, sharp, pointed tip. Mmm, ready to change the world. Oh, Mr. Penny, I could turn that pencil all night long. Oh, that grinding sound. Oh, that beautiful, beautiful grinding sound. Oh. I, I, oh, that beautiful grinding sound. I, I gotta finish these papers. And he cheats on the test I, that I created I with my yellow these papers. number two I, I mean, pencil. Perhaps we it's could discuss so this. disrespectful. He gets hundreds on every test I give him. Every test, a perfect score. He even gets the extra credit points. I have the hardest tests in this school, Mr. Penny. I'm not easy. He's making me look easy. I don't think so, Miss Harlow. There are some kids who are scared to take your class. You see, Mr. Penny, one person gets a hundred and they all believe they can get hundreds. It always starts with one and then I become, I become the easy A. I become the slut of teachers. Take Miss Harlow, she's easy. Everybody gets hundreds and then what happens to me? He has to be cheating. That's the only way anyone could get hundreds on my tests. He just has to be. He just has to be. Miss Harlow. I'm sorry, I gotta Ms. go. <laughs> Mr. Penny, I was wondering if maybe you and I could get together and co-sponsor the Bunch. I, I love Parcheesi. <gasps> Great. Mr. Penny, could you come to the principal's office? What? Could you come to the principal's office? Well, uh, is there a problem? Or, I mean, is there something could I can... Could you come to the principal's uh, office? I mean, uh, come by the principal's office or come to the office? Because I can come by the office as if it's something that can take a few minutes. Uh, you know, uh, what is what exactly is this about? Uh, is it by or to? Mr. Penny. Could you tell me more about why I have to come to the office? I mean, if, if I know what it's about, then I could be more prepared for what it's about, you know? Now, when people go to the office, 
And I know you don't know what it's about, but when people do go to the office generally, what is it about? Oh, Mr. Penny, I'm not sure what this is about. I was just asked to have you stop by the office. Stop by? Yes. But last time you said two, and now it's stop by. Mr. So Penny? is it two or stop by? Mr. Penny? Yes. What would you like me to tell the principal? Is it good? I mean, is it a good thing? Or bad? I mean, is it good, bad? Or oh, Mr. Penny, I'm not good? sure what this is about. Do I need an attorney? What? Nothing. Did you say something about an attorney? Nothing. Never mind. Hello? You there? Still there? Okay.